What's up, y'all? Welcome back to Ringmaster's Game Dungeon. My name is Patrick, and today we have an Ultimate Masters booster box opening. And I am excited. This is definitely one of my favorite products. Um, some of the best cards you can get in the Magic series definitely comes out of some of these Master Packs. So... Um, Definitely excited for this one. Okay. So far, looks like the box topper is not bent. So in my last video, the box topper came in bent. So this one looks like it's in pretty good shape. So that's good. So get all these packs out of here. And we're just going to tear them open. Put them right there. All right. Now, the packs you see here that I open, uh, I sell a lot of these cards. And um, if you guys are ever on TCG, uh, if you see Ringmaster's Dungeon, that's me. So, um, I will definitely be shipping uh, premium, never used cards for the most part. So, if you get a chance, you see me out there, you'll know you're getting your getting the good stuff all right let's see let's get it started toki foil root waula okay fauna shaman all right is our first rare is a fauna shaman cool all right we've got dreamscape artist sleight of hand buried alive or uncommons and some seriously good uncommons frantic search all right, and so many good cards in this set. And whether it's uncommons, commons, rares, mythic rares, definitely one of my favorites. These ultimate masters. All right, we got the worm and Wingstead Rider. Squee, what up, Squee? Uh, that's a pretty foil. Check that out for common. Still pretty. So we got the Goblin Nabob, <laughs> Heap Doll, Hero, Devoted Druid. It's worth a little bit. Okay, Frantic Search, Faithless Looting, and just so many good, so many good cards that come out these Ultimate Masters. Very playable, many different formats. Okay, let's keep it going. Ooh, Fomna Shaman. Double dip, but this time it's a foil version. Very nice. Okay, we'll put that in a rare pile. Tall rond. <laughs> you always gotta have a tall rond, huh? Rankless. Wild artisan. Kozilek. Kodama's Reach. Very nice little common there. All right. Let's see. Put that in a foil pile. All right, so we've already nabbed up a foil rare. That is pretty sweet, and it's a Fauna Shaman, playable card. Oh my goodness, foil Urbog. We're double dipping. We're double dipping into foil rares here. Oh, that's a nice one. Okay, Glenny Lendra, Counter Squall, Ghoul Steed, Five and Vapors. And then the, the commons here. Wow. Okay, so far our, our foils coming out all right. Only two two rare foils. Pretty decent rares too. Okay, groundskeeper. It's a pretty foil. Okay, let's put the foil there. And then we got Revel Arc. Kitchen Finks. Laboratory Maniac. Rally of the Peasants. Such good, such good uncommons and commons. To think twice. Prey Upon. Man, yeah, such good cards here. Okay. Let's see. What's up next? Reckless Worm. Golgari Grave Troll. 
Hello, Mr. Grave Troll. You are ug is a mug. <laughs> okay. Uncomments. All the combinators there. Okay. Now we haven't hit any mythic rares yet, so interested to see what we're gonna pull out the mythic slots here. There are definitely some juicy mythics up in this set, so it'll be pretty exciting. Mirror Servitor, very cool. Wow, that is a beautiful foil. That is beautiful. Let's put that right there. Daybreak Coronet. This is the rare. Ooh, Eternal Witness. Buried Alive. Sigil of the New Dawn. Very nice set of uncommons there. There's definitely some value there. Definitely some value in the, uh, the uncommons when it comes to Ultimate Masters. Let me tell you guys, if you guys are opening these, you know, don't just throw your uncommons aside. They are worth some money. Slippery Boggle. Hexproof. Okay, we'll put him there. Noble High Arc. Very nice. It's a nice rare. Appetite. War Leader. Dakmore. And all of the commons. What would we do without the commons? Not quite sure, but I'd be okay without most of them. Fairy Rogue Token. Alright, so our foil is a common. And then we got a Sovereigns of Lost Alara. Shriek Ma, Rise from the Tides, Brazen Scourge. Okay. Got our commons there. Alright, so far no mythics, and we are down to what 12 packs. So I am assuming we're gonna start dropping into some some mythics here pretty soon. Yep, they got a show eventually. Dark Dabbling. Foil. Raging Ravine. Hello, Raging Ravine. Lava Spike. Forbidden Alchemy. She Ray. Shizo's Caretaker. My goodness, the uncommons. Don't ever sleep on them. Such, such good commons and uncommons in this. All right. Pulse of Miramasa, foil. And now we got a Through the Breach. Still no Mythic. Miss Veil Plains, Spider, Elephant Whispers. All right. And a slew of commons. All right. I think we've pulled all the rares we can pull. I think, we, uh, I think we're ready to start seeing uh, Mythics now. Maybe we'll get a couple back-to-backers. All right, Whirlwind Adept. Well, that is a pretty foil, I have to admit. Very pretty. Okay, Visions of Beyond. Nice little rare there, Umbrial Rites. Well, that's one of my favorites from back in the day. Prismatic Lens. Spirit Cairn. Okay. All right, so we're sitting on a, a pile of rares, no mythics. Two rare foils, nice ones too. Nine packs to go, so I'm assuming we're gonna see at least what three or four mythics here, right? Minimum. Man, these packs are kind of hard to open. There we go. Boy, that one was extra sealed. Super duper sealed zombie. Gadok Teague is the rare. Garna, Iridescent Drake, okay, and Common Central, okay, all right, it looks like we need to start picking up the value here pretty soon, looks like quite a few packs to go, quite a few packs to go, so we're expecting to see some beef coming in, whoop, whoop, there it is, Whoop, whoop. 
Snapcaster Mage. I've been looking for one of these. Now I got them. All right, that's a nice little hit there. Unstable Mutation Angel. Sleight of hand. Juicy little uncommons. Common Central. All right. All right, we got our first Mythic, and it's a good one. Snapcaster. Absolutely, take one of those. All right, Eldrazi Conscription. That is a big dog. Put that in your... Uh, your Killian deck, huh? Vengeful Rebirth, Young Pyro, Chainer's Attic. Wow, we've seen a lot of the Chainers. That's at least the second or third one now, right? It's got to be second or third. All right, let's finish off this stack. Stack of Rooney. All right, let's see. Elemental. Spark Spitter, Pattern of Rebirth. Okay. Stream, Urban, Anger. Hello, Anger. Nice to see you. That card used to be worth a ton of money back back in the day. I don't know about a ton, but not sure what it's worth anymore. If there's any value in the uh, the reprint version? Uncommon. Holy smokes! Let's go through uh, through here. Okay, let's see. Marriott. Well, that's a pretty foil. Always likes the pretty foils, even if it's common. Spoils of the Vault. Okay, that's a rare dreamscape artist. Mahamoti Jin. Plum Veil. Plume Avail. Okay. All right, we are down to just seven packs. Still only one Mythic. That's crazy. That is crazy. One Mythic. Kind of scary, huh? Getting down to the wire here. Maelstrom Pulse. Emancipation Angel. Magma. Golgari Charm. All right. Six packs to go. One mythic still. Lots and lots of anticipation here. Just to see what else we got in this. Let's see. Lava Claw reaches still with the rares. Song of the Dam, Boneyard, Phalanx, and then all of our uncommons or our commons here. Okay. All right, Karn. Let's see what you got for us, Mr. Karn. You got a mythic for us in here? Keep doll. Ulamog, the infinite guy. All right, there's a mythic. Okay, and it's a big one. That is a big daddy right there. Whoo, teen teen, indestructible, night later four. JOC. All right, second mythic. It is about time. I was starting to get worried there. Like, hey, what's up with the mythics? You put them all, put them all in the bottom of the pack, huh? Should get at least one more or two. You know, I'd like to see at least at least two more. But boy, it's hard. It's hard to say what's going to happen with this box. Seismic assault, hyena umbra. That is cool. Yeah, that is cool. Okay, Seismic Assault. That's our rare. All right, Uncommons. All right, we are down to three Daddy Packs. And our two Mythics are Snapcaster Mage and Ulamar. Very nice. Very nice Mythics there, though. Very nice. Can't complain about those two. Ooze. Safe hold elite. Let's see what we got behind there. Celestial Colonnade. Very nice land. Mage Ring. Prowler. Travel preparations. Okay, we're down to two packs. So 
chances are getting slammed for those those mythics boy this this box is definitely definitely not being nice on the mythics that's for sure okay zombie okay we got a spirit karn cairn let's see what we got back there Bang, Liliana. Woo! Let's go, baby. Let's go. Oh my goodness, and all of her gloriness. That is what's up. Saving the best for last, huh? Ancestors chosen. Become immense. Oh man. Nice little mythics in this box. Yeah. Not very many of them, but the quality of them is definitely there. That's for sure. Liliana of the Veil. That is what I like to see. All right. Let's see here. Spirit. Eel Umbra. Last one. Ray of the Dawnbringer. All right. So this was a three mythic box. Very low on the mythics. Um, we still have the, uh, the box topper, of course. So there is a chance to get another mythic out of there. Okay. So, so far so good. We were rocking the uh the Lily, the Snapcaster and the Ulamog. Now for the box topper. Let's see what we got in here. Okay. All right. Here we go. Karn. Woo! Foil Karn. My goodness, in all of its gloriness. That is gorgeous. Holy smokes. Talk about the shine. All right. So we ended up with four mythics. We got the Karn box topper, Ulamog, Liliana, Snapcaster Mage, and a fatty pile of rares with a foil Urborg and a foil Fauna Shaman. So not too bad here and a whole stack of valuable uncommons. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed the video, shoot me a like, comment, subscribe to my channel. Uh, next box that I open is going to be double masters i'm gonna do a third box only double masters so anyway guys thanks for watching peace